say, Welcome back to the backlog! We are back to where we started. Um, I think Talking we, about Discovery Channel! Well, I, I think <laughs> this is the first uh, star that you got in the game, and now we're back doing it as a uh, speedy comment. Did you go to the first thing? Yeah. Oh, I didn't realize that. That's a very fitting way to get your 60th star. Yeah, start that, that. that's that's kind of what I thought. That was so. good. I didn't even realize you did that because I was so involved in myself. Ooh, and I, was, I didn't want to stop you long enough to tell you. That's, that's all right. I, I felt doing, I felt so. like you know what we still got to do. <laughs> oh oh, I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> was he pushing you? Out of <laughs> pushing me. It's like get out of my way. Um. So we were talking about Discovery Channel when we got a little off topic. Why do you long jump over those, man? I don't know, because I'm a lame So, um... Is there any other Discovery Channel shows or you just want to be done with that conversation? Um... Can we talk about Mythbusters? That was a good... I'm trying to think what else is on Discovery <laughs> Channel that I would watch. I don't know if I'm going to get them stopped. Oh, oh. I don't know what's on Discovery Channel either. I'm not really sure. Um... Uh, uh, I don't know. Whatever. Let's just end that discussion. Yeah, because I don't. I, can't think, I, can't, I don't have cable, so I just watch it on. Watch yeah, it on. I mean, honestly, like, we don't watch a whole lot of TV. Yeah, there's a black hole. You killed me. I didn't do it. You made me I jump. I did not. You I made I me not. jump. I was stopping that guy. Well, yes, but you made me jump. I did too. not. Did I really? Yeah, you really jump? did. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to. Uh, that was an accident. It's all good. That was an accident. They've stuck through other <laughs> silly deaths, so... Oh my gosh, that's funny. Yeah, oh, that's I totally really did not make that. Daddy jokes. So, um... I guess I lied a little bit. That's not the only permission I've been through. Uh, I'm I found last this. time. Uh, uh, there was a mission here in town. Uh, oh. For a local comic book. Uh, and I'm not going to plug it because I don't want to tell people what happened. Yeah. Uh, but we had we had one of those. I think they did it a couple years. You know which one, you know what I'm talking about? Yes. Okay. They didn't do it this year, did they? I don't think I don't think they did it for a couple years. I just remember I went one year. I think I remember reading that it got canceled this year. Oh. I just remember going one year and it was funny because, like. Half the artists were people I saw at Hastings all the time. <laughs> and you know, it was like people like, oh hey, and they do commission drawings and stuff, and like they were doing signage for people. It was like, man, I see you guys like once a week at least. Yeah. So, but it was still fun. I had a good time, but it was just, it, you know, hey, we're we're a smaller town, but like, you get what you get. So. Yeah. Um, all right, I want to stop that guy. Better look out. Better get moving, man. You only got two minutes and forty eight seconds left. So, um, uh, yeah, that, that's it. I won't talk much. I don't remember any of it. I remember that there were, um, there's a costume, like, cosplay contest. Oh. And there was, uh, some, like, kids. here there was a cosplay contest? Yeah. There's probably, like, five adults and about five kids, and they had two different cats. And, and none of which you wanted to see in cosplay. Uh, you know what? There were a couple okay. Really? I mean, not, nothing like when I went to drag. I mean, you want to talk about good cosplay? Holy crap, man. Like, I saw Robosa, and I swear to God, was that actor. <laughs> <laughs> it was ridiculous. Oh, okay. So, I guess since I got back on this, I remember we were walking across the street, and this was when the, uh, the superhero show that was on sci-fi that Stanley created. Uh, Superhuman. Is that it? Where they, like, find real-life superheroes? No. Oh. So it was a reality show. Oh! Where they, like, fleshed out their own comic book heroes. Yeah. And somebody won it. I think they might have done one or two seasons of it. Yeah, but, like, I remember that. It was This was just over, and the guy who won, I remember at one point, we saw him, like, walking across the street. I can't even remember what his name was. <laughs> Not even a superhero name was. Like, oh my gosh, it's that guy! <laughs> hey, it's that dude from the reality show! Well, we saw, we saw, man, we saw some really good cosplays, though. Uh, like, Boom! I distinctly remember, uh, uh, what is the, from Venture Brothers, the, um, uh, the girl that is, like, a villain, but is, like, from Brock's past. Uh, and she's like she's wearing like black leather. Yeah, black, and she yeah. Oh my gosh, what what's her name? name? 
Nice. You just got your 60th star, man. It's crazy. Like, it does not feel like we should be at the end of the game. Oh, that's nuts. Uh, anyways, there was a really good one of her. I saw uh, just a bunch of really good anime ones. Oh, man. I, I got a picture of it somewhere. And I'd say, hey, put it up. But I don't freaking know where it's at, so I can't believe you put it up. Yeah. But uh, there was a cloud that was, like, freaking amazing. Nice. Um, oh, speaking of cloud. So, I, a friend of mine is really into, like, um, medieval weaponry. And, and, like, he wants to build his own forge and some stuff like that. And so he showed me this video of this guy who has um, uh, this forge where he makes, like... Is he a YouTube dude? Yeah. I feel like I've seen ads for his stuff. He made, he made, like, a Master Sword. Yeah, or... and he made the Buster, like, Cloud's Buster Sword. Wow. And he said it was awesome, but it weighed, like, 200 pounds, so you couldn't actually swing it. They, like, when they went to test it, they, like, laid down a watermelon, and they had to have two dudes hold it up, and they just, they just dropped it. I think it is, I, that, that guy's been, like, I can't remember what it is, but I've yeah. seen, I've seen, like, ads. <laughs> We're going to the center of the universe. Well, why is that thing doing what it's doing? <laughs> because it can. A Mario game! Mario Logic, don't argue. Um, so, I, I feel like that I've seen ads for that, like, before some of the stuff I've watched, and I was like, yeah, you check that out. Oh, I totally thought we were just gonna like take out those ships. I think you were. Oh yeah, she, she's blowing them up, just killing people. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry about it. Rosalina's evil. You have given me power. <laughs> Rosalina's like, I'm gonna make you hurt that guy hurt on the inside. <laughs> <laughs> I Turns out, feel like what would be awesome? Like uh, Rosalina's actually the villain. <laughs> You've been like you've been helping the villain. Giving her all this power so she could power up. I know I have enough power to take over the universe. So spoiler alert. God's like, like I was trying to stop her. <laughs> spoiler alert. It kind of reminds me of Kotor Two, Knights of the Old Republic Two. There's this one person that you get in your party that she's like your mentor, like through the whole game. And then you it's very. Really play this game, right? Oh. Well, I already know what's going to happen now. That oh, yeah. Well, just, she, can say it. she turns against you, and you have to fight her at the end. And, like, if you actually use That would have been, like, real cool had I played it. If, uh, you have to, like, use her, um... Or if you use her in your party, um... Then, like, as she levels up and stuff, she's more, like, harder to fight at the end of the game. That's kind of neat. So, like, if you don't ever use her in your party, then the last, bo like, the last boss battle is just, like, super easy. So, talking about spoiler alerts, uh, so, back to another Hastings story here. So, we worked with a guy named Robert. Mm -hmm. Cool guy. I like Robert a lot. Uh, the movie The Mist had come out. Uh-huh. I love that book. And I mean, it's just, it's like, actually not even really, I don't think it was initially one of Stephen King's. Uh, stay in, stay in, oh, you're fine. I don't think it was even one, it wasn't like full length initially, it was like part of a collection of smaller short stories, although it's over her pages. Yeah. But I love the story, I think it's really good, I really enjoyed it. I never saw a movie. And I was actually... Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I heard, like my wife watched it, she didn't like it. I think I could appreciate it for what it was. Yeah. But, I mean, it's not awful, holy crap. Ooh, that was close. Oh, oh yeah. then you wrote it. <laughs> um, but, so... I knew that there was a twist, like somebody had told me, Ow. hey, there's a twist, and she oh. just got the one up there. That's what I was trying to get. I wonder if it gave it to me. I don't think it did. Um, somebody's like, oh, well, there's something that's different in the book from the movie. I'm like, oh, okay, that's cool. And so I was talking to Robert one night at work, and I was like, yeah, someone told me this. I was like, now don't tell me if I'm right or not, because I don't want to know, but... I think it's spoiler alert, so if you, if you haven't watched the movie, you don't want to get spoiled. It's really old now at this point. Yeah. I was like, but I think uh, his son's gonna die. Like, I bet that's gonna be the difference. Like, oh, dude, how'd you know that? I was like, Robert! <laughs> I just me? said, don't tell me if I'm right, <laughs> but I think. And I've never watched the movie now. Uh, because of that, I have never gone back and watched that movie. And now I actually had another friend that's, you know, kind of the same. But like, hey, it wasn't really that good, but you know, you know, he's like, hey, if you liked the book. Knowing, like knowing that there's still another twist, so you, like you, you could still be okay. You could still watch the movie and and what? Oh, the mist. The, the mist, mist, and there'd still be a twist, even though you know that. But yeah. it was just so. Hey, hey, don't tell me if I'm right, but hey, man, how'd you know that? <laughs> Robert. <laughs> so that's funny. I still like Robert. Robert's still a great guy. I was just so 
She goes, why would you say that? I specifically told you, don't tell me. It's funny. So, that, like, talking about Robert reminds me of, like, there was a lot of really good musicians that worked at Hastings. Yeah. There's, like, we worked with so many. Yep. And, like, I don't know, it's just weird. Like, I, I guess think that, Robert's still in a band, isn't he? Probably. I mean, if he's not in a band, he definitely still plays guitar. Uh, I know the Brandon, the, their band, like the band you're in, the Brandon, I don't think they're a band anymore. So, um, but there's another guy who makes music, actually. Uh, Hopping Man Media, and he's got some other stuff. Up he there. says his name. Aaron. Yeah, Aaron. Okay. Well, Aaron, who I didn't say before, but like, I think I think even on his channel, he's got a few. Uh, yeah, he was, things that he's he was putting some of the stuff up, and he actually like writes all the songs for like his videos and stuff. Oh, right. Yeah, so I'm not surprised by it. I'm not either. Well, he was initially like doing something completely different. So I've filmed some stuff like forever ago. Just about uh, just random stuff. Yeah. Uh, and he was actually gonna make a show and it just never happened. So one of the funniest. Oh, things, oh, 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 I couldn't stop him. One of the funniest things that that he ever did, and this is gonna be a little offensive. I'm gonna apologize. But we uh. were sitting there talking, and so we always had this anti-piracy ad on around <laughs> here that I talked about before, where it's like, you would steal a purse. You wouldn't. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> gotta get moving. Well, we gotta end this episode. All right, we'll just 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 keep going. I'll finish my thing in the morning. Like you wouldn't steal this. You wouldn't steal like it. Just basically it was just like you wouldn't do this. So why would you pirate a boot? Like so that was basically what the whole point of it was. Yeah. And uh, so he he came up with like this this really ridiculous thing. There was a guy that worked there. Did you ever work with Hank? I don't think you ever worked with Hank. Nope, I don't know Hank. So we were talking, and uh, uh, they're like, "Well, you wouldn't." Uh, what was that? I can't remember what we said. Like, you wouldn't uh, bomb a plane. You wouldn't. And they were just coming up with the most ridiculous things. Yeah. Like you wouldn't do this, and it was just to play off of that and make a fake commercial. And, um, he, uh, I don't know, because they actually ended up making this, and I don't know if this part of it made it in, but, Hank, I'm going to apologize, these are not my words. Hank's like, you would rape a baby. I knew like, he was going to say that. Oh, my gosh. And even Aaron was like, that's too far, dude. That's too far. And I don't think he used that one. But the thing that he made was so funny, and I actually have... I think I still have a DVD of of all of his stuff um, that he made, and it was on there because he had a bunch of like that was probably one of the funniest, in my opinion, one of the funniest things he ever made was that. Yeah. You can't get away from this guy, man. Um, was oh, was that? Well, you wouldn't bomb a plane. You, I wish I could remember what they were. So, but that that's that's the end of that story. So we. Yep. You can you can get off the well, sledge and uh, you can hit the pause button while we're in this episode. Yep. We'll that pause it right here. So, all right, uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Come back in two days for the finale of Super Mario Galaxy. What? 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 So, what? Say more in the back, love. <laughs>